We should be back. Hello. Hello, beautiful people. I don't know how to make a pond. Am I stupid? How do you add a pond? I forgot. Pools and fountains. Nope, that's not it. Oh, I, I remember. I have to lower terrain, right? Lower the terrain. Let's, let's just see what happens here. So, Ian, you're going to get a promotion here soon, buddy. And... Um, your pay, you know, we, we'll discuss your pay. Um. There's no pond at this location? I think a little pond would be fucking cute. How to add pond, Sims 4. I just haven't done this in a while. Turn the grid on. Okay. I just need to know how to put it in. A pond tutorial. Oh god, we got Pizza Hut ads. You can't out Pizza the Hut. I was gonna get Pizza Hut last night, but we decided against it because they it was just so busy. I don't know if it's a Friday night thing. Okay, we need to. Okay, how do we build this fucking thing? I forget. Oh. Oh, this is from three years ago. We have a pawn tool now. Two years ago. I had Pizza Hut last night. Really, Ian? I'm so jealous. I had a, I had Papa John's because our Pizza Hut was like fucking busy. I don't know. It was popping. You had Pizza Hut last night though. Wow. Nobody else pizzas the hut. How do you build the pond? How to use pond tool Sims 4. <sighs> I've built ponds before. Why am I having such an issue? Pond tool tutorial. I I thought you. Uh... I'm losing it. I just want to build a pond. I thought you had to lower. Okay, let me look. Simarchy. Go follow her. She looks like a nice girl. Oh, I was doing it right. Okay, well, let's try it, shall we, guys? Let's do the damn thing. I'm gonna lose it. Alright, fill water to height. Oh, sheesh. I'm kinda nice with it. Okay, let's paint this shit. You got a friend in me. Sorry. So Ian, how's um 
how's it going in uh the the dark soul um universe i've been unsuccessful in stopping by your stream i've seen you going live but i'm i'm like you're you go live really late when i'm about to fall asleep so I have been unsuccessful this weekend stopping by, so I haven't caught up on the Dark Souls tea. How's the tea? Any butterflies? I beat it. <laughs> I missed it. I mean, congratulations. That game looks tough, though. Those those games are in general tough, you know. Dark Souls and Elden Ring. It ain't an easy feat, you know. Look at that pond. That's so nice. Should we add like some mosquitoes? You would not believe your eyes. Tadpoles, dragonflies. We're going to add it all. A swan. A duck we're gonna add some ducks so basically in the sims 4 these these add animals when you put these here so there will be animals floating around a gator <laughs> we won't do that to the children more dragonflies all right so we got some boogs in the pond let's add some lily pads Let's do the big clumps of lily pads because I'm not about to individually place them everywhere. This is so cute. Okay. Um, are those floating in the air? Are those in the water? Those are definitely floating. Are those? Those are not in the water. <laughs> those are not in the water. <laughs> what in the fuck? <laughs> Why are those floating? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Why are they floating? <laughs> no, we'll just do the little Pac-Man ones like this. They look like Pac-Man. Um, you know what's so fucking funny? You gotta hear this shit. One of my kids is obsessed with Pac-Man right now. And she's drawing like cute little Pac-Man. It's kind of cute. She has like cute little Pac-Man mazes all over her like papers and stuff. And like she's making really cute little Pac-Man characters and all this. The ducks are floating. Why are the ducks floating? I don't think we can fit ducks in here, but that's okay. We'll add some tadpoles and call it a day. Um, she's drawing Pac-Man all over her papers and she brought it up to me and she goes, Miss Kataska. I'm like, what? And she's like, I started playing this really cool new game called Pac-Man. She's like, it, she's like, I think it just came out. She's like, have you heard of Pac-Man? I'm like, excuse me? Excuse me? This little six-year-old, I'm like, excuse me? <laughs> just came out? This is new game? I'm like, how have these kids not heard of Pac-Man? <laughs> I was appalled. I was, I was offended that she thought I didn't know Pac-Man. And I told her, I, sh I looked it up. I can't remember when it came out, but I like showed her. I'm like, girl, look. Girl, it's been out. And you know what she got for Christmas? Oh, don't, she's a little gamer, okay? She's so cute. She's so such a cool kid, but she got a PC. She's six. She got a new PC for Christmas. I'm like, girl, you poppin'. <laughs> you poppin'. She got a PC, a Nintendo Switch. I'm like, girl, a new, well, keyword, a new Nintendo Switch. She already had one. A PC, yeah. A few of my kids got PCs. Like, is that what it's like these days for kids? They just get PCs for Christmas? Because 
My parents would never got me that when I was six years old. They would have laughed in my face and said, girl, you tripping. <sighs> Should we do a fishing spot here? I just hate how the sign looks to be for real. We could make it really small. So the kids can do some little fishing here. Country fish. Let's do some f country fish. Yeah. Okay, let's... Yeah, I, I couldn't believe it. She's like, I, guess what I got for Christmas? She was so excited to tell me because she knows I have a PC. My kids all know. I, I just I just give them the, the straight up, yeah, I'm a gamer. What What's it to you type of spiel. And we didn't get Wi-Fi until I was in third grade. <laughs> <laughs> that's how kids are though like they all obviously have wi-fi these days and they have all this stuff i'm like oh my god these kids be popping with their little and she knows all about her pc she's like i got a, a 4080 ti and i'm like what the fuck She's just this little gamer girl, and I love her. Like, she, because her and I, we just get each other, because she's a little gamer. She's cute. Cute little kid. Like, she is what my kids will be. I'm going to have gamer kids. I will probably have the six-year-olds with PCs, and everyone's going to be jealous of, you know, their friends will be jealous. Whoops. Like, I wouldn't be a good parent passing on the family gamer genes if I didn't get them a PC at six years old, you know? And then, you know what's so cute? You can game with your kids. But I also don't want kids. <laughs> it's just the idea. The idea of if I did have kids passing down, you know, the family gamer genes. But I don't also, in the same token, I don't want kids. <laughs> it's just the ideas there. If I were to somehow have children, I don't want that for myself. But if I were, you know, you never know. You never know. I could change my mind. I really don't think I will, but I could. I could change my mind. You know what I'm saying? Does this pond look kind of murky? I'm trying to make it look like this nasty little pond. How do we... Um, oh, I think if we go into water... No. Water accessories. I think we can paint this water. Yeah. Let's make it... Green. Or should we... Pond scum. Yellow scum bag. Let's do leafy water. I like this pond. It's kind of cute. I love ponds. Okay. And then... <sighs> yeah, if I do have kids for some really fucking strange reason, they will, they will have little Xboxes and PCs and stuff. Like, I envision having a little game room at my house. You know? You know, after I marry rich, of course. You gotta... First step, you gotta marry rich. Okay, ladies? I'm a teacher. Like, I ain't gonna be the breadwinner of the family. So... I'm a teacher. Like, what do you expect? What do you expect from me, you know? Does that look good enough for the pond? I, I feel like that's kind of cute. Do, do, do. Back at me. Reflection. 
So anyways... So, uh, how y'all doing? Anything else new with anyone's lives? Okay, I gotta do some landscaping around the house. We're really almost done, like I promise. This is almost a done sealed deal. Um, we have to finish the barn, finish some landscaping up front, and then we're kind of done. Unless we find, yeah, random stuff to throw in the yard. We're pretty much done here. Pretty much done. I kind of want these hay, more of these hay bales, but I forget where we had them. I think they were from Debug. Yeah, they're Debug. I would have to go and find them, and that sounds painful. Who is that girl? I see. I don't remember the lyrics to this reflection song, but I do love Mulan. Okay. I do need more hay bales. We need to go find these. Stat. This is looking mighty cute. We have these hay bales too, but I kind of don't need these big ones. I kind of want those smaller ones to be for real. Okay. I'm going to save so we don't lose that progress. Next, we're going to, the next build we do, we're going to start building a house up here for the Spencer Kim Lewis family. And we're for sure going to have a tree house. We're going to give Olivia a tree house. Because we haven't used a tree house yet. And it would be kind of cute. Then her these neighbor kids can go play in her tree house. And then when she wants to come play in their little area, she can come down here. Another house? Yeah, I'm trying to finish Willow Creek. We're not going to start it today, though. Maybe tomorrow we'll start, like, the building the house. And then throughout the week we'll decorate it. Yeah, we got to we gotta finish Willow Creek, man. My reward is to go get some cookie once I'm done with this. Okay, debug. Oh, God, we don't talk about Bruno. Gotta find the hay bales. I think they might be from Cottage Living.
getting ready. Where's the hay bales, yo? Okay, I think it's in... It's gotta be in Cottage Living, but I don't want to pass them on accident. Alright, I'll turn it back down. I can imagine your Spotify rap just being Disney lo-fi songs. Surprisingly, last year, it, none of it was in my Spotify rap, and I feel like I listen to them a lot. Um... But this year, possibly, this that might be the goal for this year to get Disney Lo-Fi on my Spotify rap. <sighs> yes, I would agree. Um, the thing is, I listen to too much music off stream that I just don't think it'll happen because there, obviously I listen to music more off stream than I do on stream. But yeah, there's got to be some Lo-Fi on my Spotify rap. For sure. They, there's got to be this year. Well, what if I put like a little broken fence here? Nah, that's schmugly. Okay. Okay, I'm looking for the hay bales. I'm going to go down to... I'm going to assume it was from Horse Ranch or Cottage Living. And if it wasn't, then I guess we have to look through the whole freaking debug. I'm going to go down until I see some. I just want more hay bales. Is that too much to ask? Like, I really didn't think it was a big ask. Okay, cottage living. We're looking for hay bales. I would really assume it was from Cottage Living, the hay bales that I was using. I really like those ones. Every hour spent together. I kind of like this tree stump. They might use that. That's kind of cute. Every hour spent together. Watermelon. We'll have her come plant her own stuff. We'll have her plant like the fruit and stuff later on. I don't see the hay bales. I'm sad. I need them. What is this? Just dirt? Just a mound of dirt? That's just dirt. <laughs> this is kind of cute. I just, we don't have room for that. Um, I still don't see hay bales. I'm gonna cry. I really... Yes! Yes! Okay, we need two more in there. I want two more here. I want one here, one here, and then honestly, I'm gonna need a bunch for the barn. I'm just gonna put a bunch here so we don't have to come back into debug. That's what's gonna go down. That should be enough. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. I have a lot of work to do today for school stuff, and it's, like, daunting. I have none of my lesson plans done for this next week. 
And here I am decorating a horse ranch with none of my work done. You know, the usual. But you gotta have fun, you know? You gotta sometimes just surrender to being behind in your work. And go have fun. Okay. Alright, just a little bit of landscaping, guys. We have to do the inside of the barn. I'm just gonna make the inside of the barn... Well, there's kind of that... We'll do this color. Or use this one. Well, it's not really a barn. It's like a horse stable, I guess you could say. Okay, I'm gonna put some hay in here. What do, what do we put in a horse thing? Um, I know there's a horse bed we could possibly use. Some hay. Hey, girl, hay. Some hay in the corner. Zep, you're welcome. Burr, 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 burr. You're welcome. Some hay. Um, I really don't know what to put in here. I'm gonna just hang up some tools. Um, let's go to the horse stuff. Oh, we have to give our horse a ball. Like, ballin'. Let's just put that in the yard so I don't forget. Um, I know there's like a horse bed. Is this that prairie grass? No. Prairie grass hay. Hmm. Where's the- oh, the horse bed. I'm just going to put it in the middle. The horse bed. There we go. Move it just slightly. Okay. Our horse has a bed. I mean, I guess that's all we can do. And then we'll just decorate the walls a little bit with some tools. And then we're done with that area. And then we go finish the landscaping in the front. It's a basketball. It's kind of funny. Soccer ball. A baseball. Why did they do that? I'm gonna put more hay. Hey. And do a different hay design on this side. Different design. <sighs> I'm gonna try so hard to play Hogwarts Legacy today. It's not even funny. I'm going to try so hard. <clears throat> okay. I don't know. We're just going to have the ball thrown in the middle of the yard. It's not aesthetically pleasing, but it's just going to go there. Horse can play with it. Okay, this is looking good. Oh, we needed a little bit of hay for the chickens, right? No, we should be good. Oh, one more. We're one hay bale short, but at least we know where it is. I don't even remember what happened last time in Hogwarts. I don't either. You and me both. It'll be a whole new game for all of us. 
I, I have a really bad feeling I'm not going to be able to run the game, though. Then we'll... Honestly, we should just go ham and finish Sandrock. That's what we should be doing. Or we should be playing Pokemon. That's what we should probably do. Or Dreamlight Valley. We should finish those. Because if we're going to really get back into Hogwarts Legacy, then I'm going to be playing that a lot. I should just finish those other three games first. Before we, like, get back into Hogwarts Legacy again. That's what I should be doing. You know. Or League. Excuse me? You just said a curse word in this chat. I'm gonna ban the word League. I don't ever want to hear that word again. For as long as I live. I cannot with that game. I haven't played it, like, in, like, a couple years. I'm not even kidding. And I, I have no... I don't miss it whatsoever. You would never catch me playing League. Is it normal to have, like, just a bathtub chilling? <laughs> I feel like there would be a sink. A sink out in the farm. We just have to, like, find a farm sink. Nim, 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 nim. When I see each morning. Dun, 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 dun. <sighs> yeah, don't even get me started on League of Legends. I hate that game. You have to be out of your fucking mind to be a League player these days. Out of your mind. No offense. Just think about it. Imagine, like, devoting your time to a game where you're never rewarded for devoting your time. That's what League of Legends is. A game that you play, you're grinding it out, and you're never rewarded. You play for hours just to be back to square one of not achieving a single thing. That's how I feel about that game, like, truly. True. <laughs> yeah. I'm not wrong. Like, I know I'm not wrong. I know how it be. I used to play. I know what I'm talking about. Um, okay, let's... I know there's, like... I, to be fair, I wasn't like a heavy league player though. I just played because one of the boys I had a crush on liked league. So sometimes you gotta just gussy up and do it, you know? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You just gotta do it sometimes. I was his, uh... <laughs> I played the Yumi for him. Like, I would just sit there and do fucking nothing. <laughs> I hate admitting that now. I can't believe I'm, I'm telling... Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I don't want the Yumi lecture, okay? It was it was for love, but you know, that's that's the guy that I told you guys about um about the movie theater incidents. Did I, t I think I had told you guys about that. It was the same guy. I played you I I played
played Yumi for him. I had to listen to him not shutting up during movies. Like, I really went through it. And for what? And for what? What did I, what did I go through all that for? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing about those interactions was was good. And do you want to know how long I put up with this guy? Two years. Do you want to know how many of those years we were actually officially dating? Zero. Zero. Because he had commitment issues. I wasted my time. And for what? And for what? Two years of playing Yumi? And no, I didn't play Yumi for two years. I just... <laughs> two years of playing Yumi. <laughs> no, I'm not that insane. Um... <laughs> no. Nah. Not, no. That was like... I started playing League with him probably like at the beginning of when we started talking. Because I'm like, yeah, I play League. You know, I'm trying to get in his head rent free. And so I start... I would play with him at the beginning of those two years. And then I'm like, fuck this, I'm done. So then he just would play League with his homies, you know. He didn't have a Yumi to sit there and, you know, acknowledge him. But then, you know, yeah. Anyways, let's not talk about him anymore. He's engaged. I, I don't want to talk about him. I really want to know, like, what... I just want to talk to her once. Like, girl, do you want to know about my experiences? Does he still talk during movies? Like, I need to know these things. How long did it take for him to officially ask you to be his girlfriend? Because he never asked me. Never. He strung me along for two years. It was like two years of like, I don't know. It was so on and off though. It's not like, it's not like the whole two years we were like, you know. It was like whenever we, uh, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, man. It was all kinds of fucked up. Let's just say that. Never had a friend like me. What am I looking for? Ooh, let's put a star up here. But let's just be fucking for real. Would you be with someone for two years and not ask them to be your girlfriend? I don't think so. Uh, guess what? I wouldn't have said yes anyways, but... <laughs> I wouldn't have said yes anyways. Because guess what? I had commitment issues too. <laughs> but he could have at least asked. He could have at least asked. I'm just joking. By the way, I'm just joking. I actually... I'm joking. This is all well, not 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 all of it's all jokes, but like I'm currently joking. I think we were both at fault in some ways for stringing each other along, if that makes sense.
And I will take ownership of my actions as well. But it takes two to tango, buddy. Move this. I'm gonna put these tools right here. Okay. I'm gonna put like a sink out here. I don't know why. I just feel like there would be like a sink like this. Can you believe this has taken us this long? We're almost done. Oh my god, I'm on the home stretch. I kind of like this is like dirty looking one. It's kind of fugly, but I kind of like it for in here. It kind of makes sense. Okay. That's done. All right, the front needs a little bit more landscaping and then I think we're good. Um, what should we put? Should we put like a rocking chair up front? Is this the longest build you've done? Mm, no. Surprisingly, this one's went faster than a couple of them. This is no. I have done some really long builds in my days. Um, just out of this save file, though, in just this Willow Creek, I would say this one took me the longest so far. This one. And I don't know why. But I've done longer ones than any of these. I just... Not in the save file. In the save file, for some reason, this one took me the longest. I don't know what it was about it. But I, it took me a while. I think. I don't know. I just remember that one taking me a long time. Um... Yeah. I've done some really long builds, though, in my days. In general, though, these bigger lots take longer. So the bigger the lot, the longer it's going to take. This is a 50 by 50. It's going to take a considerable amount of time to do the whole lot. You have a lot to work with, especially if you're only putting one house on it. Then you have a lot of space to fill. Now, if you were to make this lot into like an apartment complex, it wouldn't, I don't think it'd take as long because it take apartments take up more space. But I could be wrong. I feel like with a house on this big a lot, you have to be able to really fill in the area. Okay, what are we going to put on the front steps? I think we just need to put a, a chair of some sort over here. Well, a little rocking chair. Like that. Cute. Fabulous. Flawless. Done. Okay, the front looks... I'm gonna get another star. 
And also, like, I feel like I take longer than the average person on builds. I've watched, like, some streamers, and they, like, do a full build like this in their whole stream, but they're not as detailed as me. They just do, like, general decorating. I'm very detail-orientated with my builds. I like them to look actually detailed. I don't like when they look, you know, flimsy. <laughs> not like I'm calling anyone's shit flimsy or anything. Yeah. <laughs> not calling anyone's builds flimsy, I promise. Okay, um... Welcome to the family, magical. Okay, I have this weird little area right here. What should we put over here? Just like a seating area? But some people builds do aren't as detailed, but people aren't trying to make them very detailed. I really want my save file to be detailed and nice because the the goal is this is the save file I'm going to eventually use to play in with my sims. So I want it to look decent and I want there to be good lore so I can have like juicy gossip when I play. Oh my god, do you want to build a snowman? This is my shit gone away we used to be best buddies and now we're not i wish you would tell me why do you want to build a snowman doesn't have to be a snowman go wait anna little bitch okay bye This kind of reminds me of me and my sister. I'll admit it. I'm definitely the Elsa and she's the Anna. Fine. Dun, dun, dun. It's like you've gone away. Doop -doop 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 -doop. I should have new emotes in a few weeks, guys. By the way. Do you want to build a snow? It takes a while to make emotes. Obviously, you guys probably know that. Just because, you know, my artist works with a lot of people. So, it just takes a, a while. New emotes! Yeah. I'm going to have... Um, I'm not going to film my tier 2 or tier 3 sub emote slots yet. I just feel like there's no point and I wouldn't expect anyone to be a tier 2 or tier 3 sub anyways. For sure not tier 3. Maybe I'll do one tier 2 sub. But tier 3 I might just fuck that. It's just so expensive. I don't even tier 3 sub to anybody so I fucking get it. That shit's whack. Tier 1 is perfectly good. I feel like for a tier two to pe for people to tier two or tier three to me, I have to have more than just emotes. I have to have like some special like shit for them. Exclusives. <laughs> and I just I'm too lazy. <laughs> I just I feel like it's just too expensive. I don't even I have Twitch Turbo, but I know. I just, I can't with ads. Ads really ruin my immersion. So I either have to sub to someone, but it's like I watch so many different streamers. I don't like have one streamer I watch all the time. I just like randomly watch different people depending on what they're doing. I just watch a bunch of random people. Like truly random. One day I'll watch like this most random person, then I won't watch them again for another six months. That type of thing. So I just did Twitch. I just have Twitch Turbo. And I, yeah, I don't even think I'm subbed to anybody. I just do Twitch Turbo because I hate ads and I watch, I don't watch anyone specific enough that I, you know, would sub.
I would, well, I would for like some friends, you know. But other than that. And also, I just don't watch, I don't have a lot of time to watch people sometimes. So yeah, I have Twitch Turbo. Let's put a nasty ass rug out here. I feel like outdoor rugs, they're not going to be very particularly nice. I just don't like... I might just scoot that all the way to the end. Have this little hidden seating area. So, yeah. That's how I feel. I know everyone has their opinions on it, though, because some people are like, well, then you're not really supporting the streamer, and I get it. I just don't watch anyone specific. If I watch someone specific, like, all the time, I would sub. Like, I, you know. I just really don't. So I get it. Uh, that's why I want to add uh, my current emotes to the follower slots. Because... I know not everyone wants this sub, and I don't. I don't give a sh rat's ass. If you want to sub, that's cool. If you don't, that's fine. <laughs> I don't give a rat's ass. But I do appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't get me wrong. But also, like, if you don't want to sub, cool. If you do, cool. So I'm going to do... Oh, anyways, this goes back to what I was actually talking about. Um, I'm going to do all new tier 1 slots. Tier 1 subs will have like 5 new emotes in all those slots. The current tier 1 emotes are moving down to follower slots. Because those are kind of the more like beginner basic emotes. Like a one with a heart. Like those are very basic. So that can be like anyone that generally is following me. Can use those. And then I'm going to have more, you know, specific ones for, you know, people that really know me. We might keep the knife one at tier one. Cause that one just that one's too good. That one you got you got to pay money for that one. But yeah, I have five follower emote slots. I do have one more animated slot, so we're gonna work on another animated one for tier one. And then, um, the crying one will be tier one still. Obviously, cause that's only at tier one. And then all new tier one like still emotes and then I might do one tier special tier two one but I won't do a tier three yet and then we're making bits badges we're doing like cute little stars and then I'm gonna add on a few more sub emote or su sub emote sub badges <laughs> because we're getting closer to the year and I only have up to nine months I think right now so I have to add on a few so we have some Hi, Adesic. What's poppin'? Adesic always makes a, a grand entrance, and I always do appreciate it. Like, he's always excited to be here. I really get that impression. It makes me feel good about myself. He always comes in with a grand entrance. It's always like, sup, nerds, or like, like something random like that. I don't even look at the name. Like, I know when it's him. I'm like, yep. That's out of sick. <laughs> I always know. I want to put something on the wall here. Maybe some moss or something. <laughs> I do. Out of a very specific person. I have never, yeah. He just chats a certain way. Very specific to him. Adesic, have you played any more Pokemon DLC? 
I've been a little bit behind in the matter. Oh, yeah. Wait. I think I've asked you this. You did beat it. I'm pretty sure. But I'm also, like, remember I have, like, brain issues. So don't, don't mind me. I don't remember what you said. It's been a while and I have brain issues. Okay, there's my little seating area. That's kind of cute. That's kind of cozy, like a little hidden seating area. All right, just a little landscaping and we're all done. This is going to be great. I'm just going to keep the same flower patterns along the house because I'm lazy. I'm freaking lazy. The light. I'm gonna put this over here closer to the flag. There's a few side events at the main school that quietly snuck in with the DLC, but I haven't done those yet. Oh. I didn't hear about that. That sounds like I'm gonna hate that. I'm going to try my best to finish Pokemon very soon. So I feel accomplished. And then they're going to have that new update on like the 11th or something. So then I'll have to do that. I'm going to try my best to finish that game. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 There's a, oh, I read that. <laughs> See, I have really bad memory. I always forget what I have read in chat. It's bad. We're dropping frames? Oh yeah, we are approaching that time. It's about that time. It's about that time. We should probably, okay, we should probably add some more lights outside, like on the ground or like street lights. So it's a little, I feel like it's a little bit too dark, but I feel like out in the country it is kind of dark. If you ever want to pick up some heavy hitters, you can always come to my world. I got all the biomes fully unlocked, so all the starters are running around. <sighs> yes, yes, yes. I do. I do, I do. I'm gonna plant some little wildflowers. <gasps> Cute. Okay. Okay, let's do a little bit of gardening over here. Little landscaping never hurt no one. We're almost done. I'm gonna do like some flowers around the horses. Maybe just around the horses. Just some wild flowers and stuff like that. Have you finished the Pokédex yet? Adesic, have you finished the Pokédex? How's that going for you? There's, there's no chance you finished it, right? <laughs> there's no chance. Uh, 
There's no way you finished it already and are just done. That looks cute. Good enough. Moving on. Alright, let's put more flowers over here. This time I'm too not too worried about the Pokédex. The main prize was what happens when it hit 200, so I stopped caring after that. Who needs a fourth Master Ball? Me. Me. I just want to finish it for the satisfaction. It's more like an accomplishment to have finished all the Pokédexes. I don't think I could move on. I've gotten this far, and I can't just not finish the Pokédex. I don't know why. It would bother me, uh, like, very much. Like, I wouldn't be able to sleep knowing that I haven't finished it. I'm just going to put a bunch of wildflowers. It's kind of like overgrown, you know. Okay. Oh my gosh. It's happening. Okay. Just a little bit of flowers in here. It's happening. Aren't you guys excited to see me do something else besides this house? <laughs> I can only imagine how annoyed you guys are about this stupid house. And us not being done yet. <laughs> Okay. Okay, it's looking kind of cute. What can I say? It needs a little bit of overgrown flowers in this little spot, I think. I like these ones too. Crystal clear. I can show you the world. I'm in the zone. Okay. Okay. I think we're done. Unless... I'm just going to quickly one more time look in the yard decorations and fill in anything I think. And then some lights, actually. Let's turn off it tonight. We're going to do lights, fill in the yard, and we're done. Yes. Do you think we need street lights or is it kind of normal for it to be dark out in the country? I feel like anytime I go to someone's house in the country, it's so dark. Unless we just add a couple of like these. I think we should add just a couple because it is pretty dark. Let's just add a couple.
like country houses are pretty dark like there's not a lot of lights like leading up to the houses Why was that not even? One, two, three. 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 Why does that look so fucking uneven? Are they uneven? Is this not centered? Whatever, I'm gonna do it like this. This whole time my front gate's not even centered. Has to redo the whole front. I ain't. I ain't. I ain't the one. I ain't the one. How does that look during the day? Good. Okay, that's cute. Okay. Now we gotta try to add some lights around the yard, I think. I think it's too dark around here. I don't know if we should do th these tall ones. Hmm. just feel like it's too dark, but I kind of don't like the look of them. What's this? Oh my gosh, it's so cute. I love that. I think we're good. Na, 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 na. Whatever, it looks good enough. All right, let's look at outdoor sculptures and add in like a couple bird baths, that kind of random stuff, a bird house. And then we're gonna call it. I think it looks great. <sighs> I'm sleepy now. All of that made me kind of tired. Some cleaning supplies. Now hold up just a damn minute. It's missing something, but I can't quite place it. The house? Really? You think it's missing something? You can't quite place it, though. I'm gonna have my sim plant a bunch of, like, fruits in these. So, yeah, that part's missing a little bit. But you think it's missing something. Hmm... That's very peculiar. This little gnome is so cute. Nah, just trolling you. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, really? And then I was gonna be a little worried. I'm not gonna lie. Like, what are we missing? <laughs> a little birdhouse. That's cute. Kind of want like a little bird bath or something. I'm kind of just filling in, you know. We just be filling in. Beauty and a beast. My reward is going to be a cookie. I'm going to go heat up a cookie after this. It's like a reward. Beauty and the beast. Where's a damn bird bath? That's a fountain. Where's the bird bath? Bird bath. Bird. Okay. It's not meant to be. Okay, we're done. 
I don't think I forgot anything. If I did, then, oh well. It's done now. Alright, we're gonna pop it on the gallery. We got all of that done. Okay, pop it on the gallery. If you guys want to use it, it's on my gallery in uh, just a second here. I'm trying to figure out what... I Usually evening looks the best. Yeah, look at that. That lighting, though. Look at how cute it looks. It's my little ranch. It's so cute. I could cry. That was a lot of work. Nine bedrooms and five bathrooms. <laughs> this luxurious ranch boasts, I wrote this. I'm, I'm a fucking author, your honor. This luxurious ranch boasts nine bedrooms, one converted to a playroom, and five bathrooms, perfect for those that enjoy ranch living. There's plenty of space for any animal of choice. The fields and cellar are excellent for any some interest in nectar making. This home also features a pool and movie theater for ranchers that enjoy the finer things in life. I'm an author. All right, I'm sharing it to the gallery. It's 402 Sage Estates because that's what the address in my save file. So whatever. That's what we're calling it. So if you guys go on my gallery, here it is. It's all done in its glory. It turned out so beautiful. Write a book. Honestly, maybe someday. Five bathrooms, and I still always have to wait 20 minutes to use one in the morning. <laughs> That's how it is with some families. This turned out so cute, though, guys. We did we did a really good job. So our next goal is the house up, up on the hill overlooking the ranch, which is the Spencer Kim Lewis family, which is an original family to the game that I do like, so I kept them. So most of the families I deleted from my save file because I couldn't be bothered, but like the goth family and the Spencer Kim Lewis I did keep because they're kind of a cute little family. So I gave them a good little remodel. We're going to build that house next, I think. So, all right, guys. Well, that's done. Yeah, my gallery is just... um. My my username. So there it is. Someone already downloaded it. Someone already downloaded it. Someone said yoink. I'm gonna fe feature it on my page, for the time being. Um, all of my lots that I put in the save file are on my gallery. All of them. My stream's gonna crash here soon. All right, we have to decide what we're going to do next. We are done with Sims. I don't feel like I want to even play Sims gameplay right now. We're all done with the Sims. I feel like we should play Sandrock. I think that's it. Let's do Sandrock. I want to get married to Logan. I think we're getting close. I should try proposing and see what happens. Most of the families I dislike, so I had them eliminated. Well, like, if you're a Sims player, you know, like, some of the families are kind of annoying. Mm. I have something stuck in my arm. Okay, hold on. So... I don't know what's in my arm, but do you guys see that little bump on my arm? Let me try to take a picture of this. You can't see it on camera. So basically, 
when I squeeze this part, there's like a little raised bump. And when I squeeze it, there's like a pebble under my skin. I'm not fucking kidding. There's like a pebble under there. I'm waiting for my stream. I should just restart my stream because it's about to F. But there's, yeah, there's like a raised bump and there's a something hard. 